Hello, I've been asked to talk about resentment and Asperger's and I had a few things I wanted to say about that. I used to have a lot more of a problem with obsessiveness and resentment. I wanted to mention that I know that there's been times where in the past I had, for instance, a conversation with mom where I would recycle like old things like over and over and over and I didn't mean to is the thing that I want people to understand about that is that when you have as many OCDs as you do like especially when I was younger they were really bad I would talk about old stuff that I was hurt by a lot but it didn't feel like it was old it felt current because when you're so hyper focused and fixated on things it feels like current stuff even though it isn't that's something I had to let go of more and more gradually as I got older I think I'm a lot better with that now and that's something that I'd have to learn, you know, in relationships too, is just how to let go of things and not hold on to things and harbor old feelings and just kind of let each day or each moment be its own thing. And so I think there's definitely a place for resentment with Asperger's as well as OCDs and fixations and just trying to let things go more and more and more. And I know it's like... For me, counseling is important, and I hate that there's such a bad stigma with, with therapy and counseling and stuff, but for me, I know that I've had, like, recycled thoughts that go through my head, like, old memories of times I've hurt someone or something, you know, like, weird recycled old stuff, and for me, counseling really helps, like, clean that out. You know, that's something that's important with resentment with OCDs is just kind of putting a finger on why something's bugging you and why like you're so affected by something and you know with me it's also just been hurting people by my bluntness and I don't mean to be blunt and it just happens and so it's like I've had my own issues with resentment and OCDs and people have had their own reasons not to like me because I've hurt people and not meant to because you know things are black and white when you have Asperger's um, but this is something I've gotten a lot better with as I've gotten older something I feel less of an issue as an adult I hope that helps and answers that person's question about resentment and Asperger's and wanting to talk about it. Thank you.